For most of the 20th century, there existed a country southeast of Europe called Yugoslavia. Today, however, what used to be Yugoslavia is now six fully independent countries, plus one more self-declared independent country, but more on that later. So why exactly did Yugoslavia split up? Well, before we look at why it split up, let's first look at how it came to be. For this, we need to go back to 1918 and the end of World War I. Yugoslavia was created from the Kingdom of Serbia, the Kingdom of Montenegro and what used to be territories of the Austria-Hungarian Empire. The country was originally called the Kingdom of Serbs, Croats and Slovenes but later changed its name to the Kingdom of Yugoslavia. This lasted until about 1941 when Yugoslavia was occupied by the Axis powers of Nazi Germany and Fascist Italy during World War II. The ruling political party in the country was the League of Communists. There were eight members, the six republics, as well as the two autonomous provinces of Serbia, Vojvodina and Kosovo. In 1986, Slobodan Milosevic became the leader of the Serbian branch. Why, 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 why
Hi. Due to the escalating violence in Croatia, the presidents of all six republics were called to The Hague by the European community to discuss possible peace plans. The Croatian president, Franco Tuzman, claimed that Croatia had every right to secede from Yugoslavia. But the war in Yugoslavia was not just between Croatia and Serbia. In fact, by far the bloodiest war in Yugoslavia was the Bosnian War. Bosnia and Herzegovina was the most multicultural of the republics and had three main ethnic groups. The largest were the Bosniaks, often referred to as Bosnian Muslims, but there was also a very large minority of Serbs and a smaller minority of Croats. Bosniaks and the Croats signed a peace treaty in Washington as the Americans demanded that Croatia stop their war against the Bosnian Muslims or face sanctions. They agreed to this as they wanted help from the West to retake their own land in Croatia. In February of 1994, a mortar attack on Sarajevo's marketplace caused the death of 68 civilians. In response to this, NATO issued the Bosnian Serbs with an ultimatum.